In this video we will see the simulation of IoT based fire detection using 8051 microcontroller. Here we have 8051 microcontroller and 16 by 2 LCD display. And a relay to control output load and a relay driver IC. In most of the simulation softwares the Wi-Fi module is not available. So, we are connecting our Wi-Fi module to the COM port of the computer. This the COM pin here also called COM connector, connected to a COM port. The Wi-Fi module used by us. For this project works at a particular board rate. Which needs to be set as seen here. Next, we will see how we connect the Wi-Fi module to the computer. This is the virtual terminal. So the serial communication between the controller and Wi-Fi module can be seen. So before going to the hardware we will see how to dump the program in the controller and edit. Let us select the HEX file for this project. This is the hardware required to be connected to the computer. This is the USB to TTL, the USB mini cord. ES8P266 Wi-Fi module, power supply for the Wi-Fi module. Connector to connect the adapter or battery to power the Wi-Fi module with 5 volt DC. We will now connect this module to the computer and see the simulation. Let's power up the kit and start the simulation. As displayed our Wi-Fi module is now connected to the Wi-Fi router through the AT commands. The project is now sending the data to the server as displayed on the virtual terminal. The LCD displays no fire detected, and the same is seen real time over IoT communication. The chart shows the field label value as zero and the same is seen as not active on the graphic button displayed. So when the input logic is changed to zero indicating fire is detected, the same date is being set to the cloud, relay is switched on, field label value changes to one and fire detected is displayed on the LCD. Also the graphic button gets activated and turns red for alarm, and the real time data can be seen on the chart. as the input from the flame sensor changes. The same is reflected on the cloud as shown. This way we can send any data to the cloud and show its impact through graphical representation.